I'm so, so excited to welcome a great friend, the one and only Craig Lucas! Can I say I'm in awe of you for so many reasons. You've created so much music. And then also your academics have never taken a sidestep. Well, they have now. I mean, I finished. But um, you finished. No, I that's finished. what I mean. You, yeah. you did. And oh. I'm, that's, that's incredible, man. Like, honestly, for you to, to do both and, and show that it can be done. I know that it's incredibly difficult. But yeah. I just want to say that I'm really proud of you for doing that. I, I just want to give the music a proper chance as well. So yeah. I think one or two years, just put my focus in this entirely. See where it takes me. Again, if it doesn't work out, you know, I'll try some other things. And if I can balance it, I'll balance it. But for now, it's music. Um, again, just like going with the flow, going where the music takes me. Yeah. Um, and enjoying it, man. I am enjoying yeah. this so much. I'm enjoying being in studio. I'm enjoying writing. I'm just enjoying the whole process. Let's get this thing properly set up. A song called Falling in Love will be on everybody's playlist from 12.01 tonight. I know it will be, but tell me a bit more about the song itself. It's not necessarily about love that's being reciprocated, but it is a love song nevertheless. Okay, hold on. So are you saying that this song basically alludes to the fact that perhaps it's about falling for people that are maybe not available? Absolutely. Um, which is essentially every person I... <laughs> oh, no. yeah, we, you know I've what? ever talk had feelings about forever. Talk about it. Let's, we, we have to talk about it. It's important. Do you know, I joked on on social media a while ago. Yes. It's like, I just really need someone to break my heart so I can start writing songs again. Everyone's like, no. First heartbreak. I wrote this song in my <laughs> car. And it's really sad that heartbreak is what inspires me. Actually, now that I think about it, that's kind of messed up. It's um, not messed up at all. Like, I know there's a couple of artists like, you know, Adele and Taylor Swift and Sam Smith. And there's a lot of heartbreak that is the fuel. Because the thing is, it's about outlet, isn't it? And yeah. remember that when you do put that into the universe, I think that people who have that same feeling, you're actually gathering a crowd of people <laughs> saying, me too, Craig. Yeah. And isn't that power? I feel like that's so powerful. You know, it's the biggest blessing about being able to write songs. Yeah. And you always, I write these songs from personal experiences you know the song is about one specific boy after one specific night and i shared a bit of it on social media and so many people are inboxing saying we've been there um yeah. and it's it's been a theme with all my songs and i just think it's to be able to share that um i think being a musician can be really lonely a lot of the time people think it's like you're around people all the time but it's it's a very lonely industry um i think the entertainment industry at large and so I always find solace in that. It's like, yeah. that's the community. You know, <laughs> it's not the people at the parties and at the events, that's yeah. the community. So yeah, that's great, that's great. And it's funny now because it's like, the song is about me admitting that I'm toxic and now all these other people are coming out, they're like, oh, me too. <laughs> it's like a toxic support group. Hi, I'm Craig and I'm also toxic. <laughs> It's great. Wow. <laughs> this is, but this is what we need more of, man. It's, it's that type of honesty, but also it's the honesty that's in the other direction as well. It's like pointing at you and saying, yeah. you know, uh, I'm sorry to quote Tay, but like, it's me. I'm the problem. I, I'm, I'm the, the problem. I told that to my psychologist and he and? burst out laughing. Because <laughs> um, I was, funny enough, I yeah. was talking about this boy. Yes. And I was explaining it to him and he's like, oh, so it seems that you, um, you're like attracted to boys that are toxic. And I was like, no, I am the common denominator. Yes. I am toxic. And he burst out laughing. He said he's never heard. It's like people come to him and his job is to get them there to admit it. I just yes. came out swinging. I was like, listen, <laughs> I'm toxic. I'm the, it's why I'm here. But it's not, it's not beat around the bush. But this is perfect. I think <laughs> it, I, I, I would love for you to be an advocate for more people saying what they need to say about what they are. And, and that's it. Yeah. So it's got to be, you know, if you're toxic, say it. Yeah, what's See, Taylor's album called Tortured Poets Department? So I'll call mine the toxic, the toxic, <laughs> the toxic, <laughs> the toxic boys department. I feel like if I give you a traffic report, you'd be able to clap it. What, singer? Yeah, like I think I'll, I'll give you a little backtrack, right? And then I feel like you would you'd nail traffic. I think it'll be so easy for you. Craig Lucas sings you oh. traffic <laughs> on the flash drive on KFM 94.5. Let's roll with this song. An observatory, there is an accident on Main Road and as he wrote 
on Jake's head will drive north as an accident before Franz Kondrati. The right and the center lanes are obstructed. And traffic is slow down off the Viking Way. In that thing there is a truck broken down in the left lane on Viking Way. On Valhalla Drive on the end to our going, there is a vehicle broken down in the left lane. After Jack's careful drive in Sandy Dust here at Vegekraal Road in Government Becky. <laughs> On the end, one outgoing at Club Mitz with one lane closed. On Solaris Pass in both directions at the hairpin bend and Jackman Speed Drive remains closed. And that's all the traffic for today. You are incredible, and I'm looking <laughs> forward to this new era of Craig Lucas. Thank you know, you, you your energy is good. You are happy. You, I feel like the happiness is is the journey that you're on right now, which is so exciting for me. And more importantly, the music that's going to come out of you. 